The Greensboro city manager now wants a say in the future of body cam footage during an incident at his home. Taiwo Jayoba and his attorney say they want to be involved in the case. You'll remember police officers were called to the city manager's home for some sort of family dispute back in December. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake was in court today. Amber, we are still in a holding pattern here. That's correct. Today in court, we heard from the city manager's attorney and the attorney for the news and record who initially made the motion to get the footage released. Quick rundown of how we got to this point. Officers were called to the city manager's home on December 28th for a family dispute. Police reports list the city manager and his two adult daughter, daughters. They are each listed as having apparent minor injuries, but no charges were filed that night. In February, a judge allowed Greensboro City Council to view body cam footage of the incident at Jioba's home. City Council described it as a private family matter. Another judge ruled that parts of the body cam footage could be released to the public by March 4th. A motion was then filed by Jioba's attorney to intervene in this case. Yesterday, the city of Greensboro appealed the judge's decision to release the footage. That brings us to today where the motion to intervene happened, filed by the city manager's attorney. It was set to be heard in court. Judge, I just filed a motion to reconsider, uh, which I, I, I think we've got a, a more steep uphill battle with regard to the appeal um, as it relates to the motion to reconsider, assuming that my client is allowed to intervene. I think that there's an argument that even though the case is on appeal, uh, it's such a proceeding. The motion are you to asking the other thing? We are. Now, the attorney representing the news and record opposed the motion to intervene, saying another judge already ruled on this case. Mr. Jayoba had actual notice of this proceed of the action filed. It's not like he didn't know about it, um, and he came on in only after the fact when he knew that part of the recordings were going to be released. The next hearing is set for March 18th. This will determine whether Jayaba's attorney can be involved going forward. As far as the appeal for the release of the body cam footage, it could take several months until a three-judge panel makes a decision.